Hello and welcome to Furrier's World, where we are back on Project Ozone 2, doing things and stuff and things and stuff and stuff and things and things and stuff. We have been looking at putting machines uh, attached to our ME system. These are the machines. This is our ME system. This is the reactor that's going to power it all. We've got, so far, a furnace, a pulverizer, and a pulverizer furnace combination. That's, that's the wham-bam combo there for the pulverizer furnace, don't you know? Uh, we need to get those connected, get those powered up. Uh, I want to get them done before I, I put any more machines out, because I think I'm going to put a load of these these out, uh, the, the induction smells. I think I'm going to stick a few of them out there, because I don't like them doing more than one job. Uh, that's, that's what I want. I'm, I'm very particular about that. I'm very, very fussy about that. Let's get some power on those machines. This should cause the reactor to cascade and activate. Although it does look like the reactor is active. No, it's not active. Is it saying it should be active? Let's see. What percentage is it at? 13%, so it shouldn't be active. Well, that does look like it should be. Hmm. Well, okay. Whatever. I'm sure it knows what it's doing, so we'll 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 leave it to it. That's what we. That's the decision I've made there. The executive decision. We're just going to walk away and leave it to it because the, the the anything else is going to confuse my brain. Uh, it may. Yeah, it's done something now. I think. No, no, it hasn't. It may do. These these power conduits that we're using here store a hell of a lot of power. So so hopefully it will induce some sort of activity in them. There we go. Bring that out like that. Then bring it along here like uh, this to a point where it's not going to interfere with that. And then we can go upwards. Like that. One up there. And... Is this the one? This is the one that we got to go up. And we can, we can actually do that. Okay, that's wrong. We need that to go up there, please. Thank you, game. That was, that was very sweet of you, game. And we're going to bring our ME cable up this one. Which we're going to, you know, have issues with and have trouble with. And, and regret and crimination and all that sort of shenanigans. It's all good fun, don't you know? There we go. Uh, is that going to power the reactor? It might not. I mean, it's not going to put an obscene drawer on it, but it's going to put some drawer on it. I'm sure the reactor knows what the reactor's doing. There we go. Those machines all hooked up and actually all powered. Uh, augmentation, we've now got three available slots for augmentation because these are top tier machines, so we can make these machines whiz, bang, and or fly. And that's a beautiful thing to be able to do. Yeah, we are fully switched off, fully charged. So it had it had tricked the, tripped the reactor. I thought it had done something. As soon as I connected those, I thought it triggered something here. Is it still drawing power out? No, nah, it's not drawing any power anymore. Okay, that's okay. So let's get some ME cable on that. I think we're probably going to need to craft some ME cable. We've got 14 honors, but you know, you know what it's like. You know what it's like. Uh, ME cable. We've only got 52 glass in there. That could be a problem. Craft. Um, 40. It can do it. It's off. It's off and running crafting 40 Fluix cables. We've got dense cable, so we might have to take the dense cable down there and have a mooch around just to see if we can get close enough to this to, to bring a cable over, because this is going to be what, an input and an output, an input and an output, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six, so six cables we need over here, so if we can bring the dense cable roughly approximately over to us, we can tap off that easy like. Let's bring this along. The back, like so. Is that in the right place? That's roughly in the right place. So we can now use that with the 14 we've currently got in our inventory. And we're going to bring it up here. That's what we're going to do. Ew, that was kind of in my face a bit, wasn't it? I can't get up there now. That's annoying. We'll have to get rid of that. Alright, up, up we go. 
up, up, up we go. Now we can't do walking on air, because we've, we've, we've kind of boned ourselves a little bit here. We'll have to dig our way out. Uh, we're never going to be able to get out of this, are we? What we can do, what we can do is we can put that around our neck, and that will give us a little bit of an extra hop, hoppity hop there. It's been a bit of cunning thinking there for a second. We needed cunning thinking when cunning thinking was needed. We got the cunning thinking, and the thinking was good and cunning and, and stuff. And that's what saved us there from sheer being stuck in a hole forever type shenanigans. Which is not good. It's not cool. It's not clever. It's not impressive. It's, it, it, it's just silliness. Silliness of being stuck in a hole forever. Right, that's going to come up there. It's going to go over the top of this and along and hook onto all of these machines. Honest it is. I need to get rid of that thing now. That's why we haven't got it on permanently, you see. It's a really useful thing to have, but when it's on permanently, it's a pain in the ass. So we'll bring this along here. Oops. We run out. That's okay. We're making more. We knew we would run out. It's fine. So we want interfaces and we want import buses that's correct that's correct that's exactly what we want so while we've got all our 40 flux cables in there let's make uh, we should be able to craftable shouldn't it interface interface we need three of them it's got enough stuff in there off you go it's going to run out of stuff sooner or later. It's got to. Three interfaces. Excellent. Did we put the import buses in this or not? Do you know? I don't think we did. I don't think we've told it how to make import buses yet. And that's kind of critical to the piece. Import bus. Should we give it this recipe to make... Uh, pattern terminal. Do we have any blank patterns? We don't. Okay, make me 10 more blank patterns. Shouldn't be a problem. Fairly quickly done. Here we go. 10 more blank patterns. How much iron have we got? Not a lot of aluminium. We've got crap tons of aluminium ore, though. We haven't done much with aluminium, and that's why we haven't got much of it. 2,345. I've put emerald upgrades on the drawers that hold redstone and iron. And sand, but uh, that sand's irrelevant, really. Import bus. Yep. We need a sticky piston on that bad boy. Uh, can you make me one sticky piston, please? There. Craft me one of them. Off you go, then. Right. We should be able to click that, click that recipe in again. There we go. Perfect. We've got a pattern for it. Uh, we'll take one, two. We can only make one. All right, okay. Import bus. We've already got th three import buses. Why? Weren't they interfaces? Didn't we make three interfaces? Why is it saying import buses? We asked... Oh, cr it is a craftable. Well, that makes no sense to me. Okay, um, three of them then. I am confused. Mightily confused there. Something something has confused my head. Uh, you can have the import buses back then, because you've got six of them now. Uh, you can have that one back, yeah. Now now I'm really confused. Now I've, I've kind of... I've made another recipe for something we've already got, apparently. What kind of freakery is that? There we go. Cleared the recipe. Cleared the recipe. You can have that back. There you go. Perfect. Confused, but perfect. Uh, Fluix crystal glass cable. That's the stuff we want. I mean, it's, 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 it's probably dangerous stuff to have trailing around all over the place. Someone walks into this, they're going to cut themselves. It's glass cable, for God's sake. 
Alright, that's got to go like that. That's got to come down like, like that. We probably also want that. And we probably also want that. Does that look about right? It looks a bit derpy, doesn't it? We could just do that instead. Oh, no, because then it does that, and that's even worse. Alright, we'll, we'll go with that. That should do the trick anyway. Alright, so, for this one, we want an input there. Nothing on top. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Yes, we do want something there. We want the orange there, don't we? We're going to send everything that this produces. We don't want to do that, do we? We want to bin the byproducts. That could be messy. Binning the byproducts could be messy. We'll need a bin back here and we'll just need to tap off to get to the bin. Okay, that's fine. Uh, this one doesn't have byproducts, so it's going to come in at the top. And it's going to go out on the side like that. That's perfect. So we need that to be just the primaries, red. We don't want any secondaries. We're going to send the secondaries out that one. Like that. And then we're going to bin that back there somewhere. Secondaries, generally not a problem. For this one, certainly not a problem. So we're having input on the top, output there. It's just if if it produces a secondary of something it can't f smelt, it's going to jam. And we don't want jam. Jam's not good. So we want that to be nothing, that to be nothing, that to be nothing. So that should all work now. Uh, no, because we've done that wrong. That's the input. There we go. Perfect. So we want interfaces. We need these to be the tiddly interfaces on top of this one. I'm thinking. There. And there. And there. Excellent. And then output there. Output there. And output there. Perfect. We could suck up the secondaries. If we had another import bus, yeah, everything's just gone blue. Perfect. We could just suck up the secondaries. That would clear them out of the way and save us having to bin them. We are going to get crap in the ME system that we don't really want, but what do we do about that? What do we do? Do we bin it? Do we suck it up? Let's bin it. Can you make a trash can in this? We can because I've already made one once trash. It is. Smooth stone, stone, and a chest. Okay, we can do that. We can do that easy enough. And we'll need some item ducts as well, and they should be in one of these boxes somewhere. Where do we put the item ducts? There, here. Item duct opaque. Excellent. And smooth stone is in this one, I want to say. Yes, it is. We've probably got enough to make everything we need here, but we haven't got enough actual... That's not how you make a chest. Furrier's World. You know this. Muppet. Muppet of the highest order. That's not how you make a chest. Chest. Uh, smooth stone. Uh, stone. Wrong. Let's just do this. Got it. Let's go put this in place, and let's offload while we're here. Ah, uh, here it is. We've got another one of them, and another ten of them. We've got loads of chunk loaders and spot loaders now. The game has been really kind with things that I don't really need. So let's get rid of our secondaries on that, and then let's go and set up some programs. We also need some additional machines as well as this. This is, this is the fundamentals. The fun dermentals. So we want that and that and that. And we'll have it back here just so we can use it for other machines if we need to. But everything here should be good. I'm content with, with that so far. We could do with linking our obsidian chest which is way the hell back here and not entirely impractical let me see what we see if we break that perfect, Flux cable 
Let's stick a in storage storage bus on on that bad boy. If we can quickly knock together a storage bus. Uh, S T O R A G E storage bus bus. Let's try bu bus bus. There we go. Storage bus. So that's an interface and two pistons. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. Let's go for the pistons. We want an interface craft one of them next. Start. We want piston number one. Uh, craft one of them next. Start. And piston number two. Oh, I should have done this in the other order, shouldn't I? Craft one next. Start. That's going to take the piston we just made. Yep. We had that problem last time as well. That's a recipe we probably need to automate. If we're going to use a lot of storage buses, we need to automate that bad boy. There's the storage bus. We've still got the cable on us. Yes, we do. Let's go get the obsidian showing up in the ME system. And then we can automate the construction of hardened glass. And that, I think, is a, is a tick in a box. And we will slap that on the side of there. Perfect. We'll wait for that to go blue, and then we'll go and check whether obsidian shows up in our system. There we go. It's gone blue. Let us go see what the hell is happening down here. Obsidian starts with an O. There it is. 1,728 obsidian. Perfect. Excellent. So, I think from Furrier's World, where we've now wired up all our machines that we've got attached to the ME system, they just need programming, we are going to say, ta-ta for now.